All right, good morning. It's uh, New Year's Day, January the 1st, 2021. So hopefully this year is a little better than last year. Hope everybody survived the New Year's. Um, so I pulled the truck over into the shop here. And uh, today's project is we're gonna try to get the generator off this truck. Uh, that's gonna include taking down all the, the wiring underneath and uh, inside and do everything. Get it off and then if we have enough time by the end of the day for that, after that, we're gonna try to get this step off of here. I'm gonna take that step and put that step on the uh, other truck. Here, I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. There's an air leak. It's this valve right here. So I'll do my best to, to get that fixed too. Um, I know this truck looks a little rough because it's just got old regular junky old wheels on it, but uh, I am trying to keep it in decent running condition. Just in case I have to call it out of retirement. <laughs> but uh, so yeah, so I wanna, I wanna fix that air that air leak. So the first thing I'm going to do is uh, whoop, um, is disconnect the batteries on this side here. Get up in the sleeper. I got to disconnect this uh, that that power box, that junction box. There's a black box right there. Got to disconnect that. This cord right here is for the air conditioner. That's another thing. We'll get the air conditioner down. But we can wait till we get to that point until uh, we get all this done. This right here is the cord going up to the control box for the generator. So we got to get that. But that's uh, that's what we got to do today. So uh, I'm going to start on the inside first since I'm not too dirty yet. And then uh, work my way around. So uh, I'll keep you updated with the progress we make. All right, we got most of the... Uh, inside done I've got everything disconnected off the wall breaker box so next thing to do got the wires disconnected on the battery uh, next thing to do is <laughs> the dirty work got to crawl up under the truck and uh, unzip tie everything Here's the control box. I messed, this is that other generator. I messed with it and I couldn't get it going again. So that's why I decided just to go ahead and take this one off. But uh, I've had people tell me, why don't you just buy a new one? Well, they're expensive and this one works. So uh, hopefully after me messing with it, it'll work after it'll work, but uh, it should be all right. I'll get a couple years out of it. We still got to get the uh, air conditioner off the top. That's pretty easy though. That's not hard. So I'm thinking I'm going to go have a cup of coffee, crawl up under the truck and uh, get everything loose from under there. So talk to you in a bit. All right. I'm making pretty good progress here. I'm trying to get this step off of here right now. I've already loosened up most of the bolts and I got the tractor up underneath it to see if I can hold it here. So let's see what happens. Got my big, my big DeWalt out here. I've already loosened this. I had to use a breaker bar to get some of these loose. So let's see what happens. So that one's loose. Here. You guys probably just can see my fat belly here. I'll see. All right, bolts are loose. I'm gonna turn the tractor on. It's get a little noisy here. Let's see if we can get it. Get this out of the way so it doesn't fall. Look at that. 
piece of cake. <laughs> All right. All right, let me get this out of the way. a little easier than I thought. I had already used the breaker bar to, uh, as you can see, I broke one of the bolts. I'll knock that out. I'm just gonna throw some paint on there. Um, let's go over here. I've got, uh, I've got everything undone from underneath the truck, all the wires and cables and hoses. Uh, the only thing I have to undo is the fuel lines. And, um, and then we'll get the forklift over here and pick it up. I've already loosened up some of the bolts for it. And uh, so we're almost ready over here. All right. All right. I think uh, we're ready to try to get this one off. Make sure I got the right tools. the DeWalt all right we're ready for the next one here kind of hard for you guys to see what I'm doing hang on a second I'll set you right there for right now even then my arm is going to be in the way but this only take a second hopefully guys back over here so there should be nothing connecting the generator to the trailer we just got to kind of wiggle it off of there or to the tractor wiggle it off there it's gonna get noisy I gotta turn the tractor on So I got a little bit ahead of myself. I got too excited. I forgot to disconnect the coolant lines. So I got <laughs> So anyway, the valves are right here. I'm just going to disconnect them from right there for right now. But I uh, got a little bit ahead of myself. So I got to do that. Let me do that and then we'll get it off the truck. All right, made a little bit of a mess, but I think we're ready to go. Try it again here. Set you guys up so you can see what's going on.
I got done what I wanted to do. We got the generator off the truck. So we're going to clean it up. We still got to replace that seal. I'm going to get a new exhaust pipe to put on there. We'll clean all that up. Probably get some new belts. Go ahead and change the filters on there. Get it all ready. We got this box over here off. So. Now I'm going to have to mount this a little different because this is just going to fit in that hole on the trailer. But I got used to stepping on that big step. So I wanted to get it, I wanted to put it back on this other truck or put it on this other truck. But we're going to have to kind of finagle it a little bit how we're going to put the holes there and uh, and drill the holes in there, but we'll figure that out. Other than that, just got to clean up my mess a little bit and go park this truck and we'll call it quit for today but i got done what i wanted to do um so tomorrow's saturday uh we'll just keep doing whatever we got to do and uh, we gotta get the air conditioner off the top up there but uh believe it or not that's a fairly easy job that's not that hard it's not dirty either all right, that's it. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.